and you reach out to us and we try to put them to the Cheaters Hotel test. Now, Kayla has reached out to us. Good morning, Kayla. Tell us a little bit about your boyfriend. Is it Darren? Yeah, so my boyfriend Darren, we've been together for like four months and I just have this feeling like he's cheating on me. So I just feel like every time he comes over my house, he's like kind of jumpy. And I don't know, I have this feeling like there's just something wrong. And I've never been the kind of girlfriend that like goes through his, you know, my boyfriend's phone or something like that. Like, I don't want to be crazy or anything. Right. I don't know. I just, I can just feel it. And I'm actually scared to go through his phone. I'm like, I don't know what I'm going to find. And yeah, I just have this feeling like something's not right. And I think he might be cheating on me. Kayla, here's what we're going to do. We're going to call him up. We're going to put him to the Cheaters Hotel test. Does that work? Yeah. And hopefully we'll get some answers for you. Catching cheaters one at a time is Cheaters Hotel, only on Power 1043. Okay, so we've been talking with Kayla. She says her man has been jumpy. Every time she uh, goes over to his house, he's always really kind of like, there's something off about him. Yeah. You know, she hasn't gone through his phone. She's afraid to go through it, but she feels like he might be cheating, and there's just that vibe that's going on. Mm-hmm. That's why we're calling Darren up. Candace Kay is going to offer him this trip with all the changes because of the coronavirus. Right. So hopefully, we'll be able to get some answers for it. Let's go ahead and do it. Aloha, is this Darren? Yes, it is. Who's this? Aloha, Darren. My name is Sharon. I work with a travel agency here in town called Aloha Vegas Getaways. Just giving you a really quick call to let you know that your name has actually been selected as one of our weekly weekend getaways to Las Vegas, all because your good friend took a trip with us. He signed you up for the weekly flyaway. So, congratulations. It's your lucky day. We drew your name. You're this week's big winner, which means a free trip to Las Vegas. Really? Sounds fantastic. Yeah, let me tell you what you're getting set up with, okay? Okay. So you're getting two round-trip tickets to Las Vegas from Honolulu, a two-night stay in one of the MGM Grand's 1,300-square-foot parlor suites, some custom-made bathrobes for you and your guests, plus food and gambling credits. Now, Darren, best part about all this, no strings are attached. We don't need a credit card or deposit or anything like that. All that we need to move forward is the first and last name of your guest, and then I'll sign you up and you can take this vacation uh, whenever you want. Do you have an idea of the person you'd like to bring with you to Las Vegas? Oh, yeah. Yeah, completely. Um, I want to bring Kayla. Okay. Because this trip is free and it's good for one year because, you know, travel restrictions at the time. In the meantime, we're actually going to be sending your guest, Kayla, a dozen roses as a courtesy. So with the roses, I just need a quick note that you would like to leave for her. It could be short and sweet. It could even be playful and sexy. It's totally up to you. Oh, that's fantastic. Yeah, sure. Um, I want the note to say you're the one I've prayed for. So sweet. Okay, got it. Easy. Hey, Darren, this is Dex, and you are actually not getting a trip to Vegas. You're actually on our radio show, Dex and Candace K on Power 1043, and we're doing something where we test relationships out. It's called Cheaters Hotel, and you pass, buddy. Kayla's actually Yay. on the other line. She thought you might be cheating. That's why she reached out to us, and you wanted to take her. That's amazing. Wait, she, she thought what? Hi, babe. But babe, what, what's going on here? I just, I thought something was going on. Why would you think that? You know I love you. I mean, what the hell? Babe, listen, listen. Okay, every time you come over, you just act so weird, and I just never understand why. Oh, my gosh. I'm not acting weird. I'm not doing anything. Okay, so then why? When you, Whenever you come over, why are you, like, so jumpy and just... There's something up lately. Like, what is it? It's nothing. It's nothing serious. No. Then it's something. Yeah, what's going on? No, I'm, I'm not cheating on her. It's nothing. I mean, why am I getting pressed on this? Why? Please just tell me what's going on in your head. I just, I, I'm not buying this. I feel like there's something going on. Just tell me what it is. Babe, listen, I promise I will tell you later, but just not here. Mm. So there is something to tell. It's nothing big, though, but you're going to be mad. Oh, my God. Okay, so I'm going to wait. You're cheating on me. No, I'm not <sighs> cheating on you. Stop it. I am not cheating on you. Okay. Then what? What is going on? Oh, God. Um, your mom's hot. <laughs> What? what? Ah, you're taking out my mom? No, 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 no. If I act weird, I just think she's hot. It is not a big deal. I want you. Not her. I want you. Do you? Yes. Oh, my gosh. Honey, listen, babe, I gotta go. I love you. I will see you later. Wait, no, 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 no. Do not no. go. Have you talked to the mom? There's nothing going on with the mom. You just find her very attractive, and that's why you're acting weird? That's it. That's all it is. I swear. Like Stacy's mom has got it going on, but Kayla's mom has got it going on? Yes, exactly. Kayla, where are you at on this? Did you see this coming at all? No. 
Yeah, no, I was not expecting that. Oh, my God. I don't know. That just feels weird. Okay, that's something that you could have kept your entire life. You should have just made something else up. Come on, Darren. I couldn't think of anything to excuse it with, and it just it came out. But honestly, it's one of those wonderful things because, Kayla, you are a spinning image, and you are going to look even better when you reach her Oh, my God. <laughs> oh. This is so weird. Oh, yuck. Okay. Kayla, is your mom hot? Apparently. <laughs> Did you ever notice that he, like, kind of looked a little bit too longingly towards your mom? <laughs> no. Oh, my God. Darren, I had no idea. Honey, I love you. I am attracted to you. I don't want it to appear as if I'm flirting or anything because it could accidentally happen, and I don't want it to. You're right. Maybe you should have just talked about this. Like, <laughs> no, I'm glad you didn't. This has been so entertaining to me. Oh my God. Please don't tell your mom that. Please don't. <laughs> So are you going to get past this, though? Do you need more time? Oh, I don't know. I, yeah, I think I'll get past it eventually. Kayla, best of luck to you and Darren <laughs> as you guys try to get past this mom hump. Oh, that's not Ew, the way to put that. That's something Sorry. he would want to do. Uh, what? Best of luck to you guys. Mom Thank hump. you. Thanks, guys.